Hey guys, Dr. John Russin here. We're talking about re-implementing the squat pattern into programming. After an injury, after some time off, one of the biggest mistakes people make is going right back into the rack, getting a bar on their back, loading it maximally, and ending up with this vicious injury cycle. So where we usually start our athletes after physical therapy, after rehab, and before they get into the gym and a return to train program is with the bottoms up goblet squat. So this has a couple advantages for us. We can actually start this with the reverse method, having the bottom position being the most stable because we have the butt in contact with the box. We can position the feet ideally based off of the person's body type, their hip structure, and the way that they intention their hips and their core. So Lindsay's gonna get stacked here. She's gonna have perfect orientation of the ankles, the knees, and the hips together. And you can notice that she's in a spinally neutral position. From this position, we're going to get the goblet and we're going to put a dumbbell right in front of the body. Notice that Lindsay is squeezing her hands tight. Her elbows are driving down and together and she's going to stand straight up from this position. Good. And then coming back and we're going to reset between each and every rep. Again, this isn't a way to load or get a training effect. This is a way to rebuild the squat pattern. So we can see that we're strong and steady and we have no flexion extension moments happening at the spine and we are really just grooving this movement pattern to relearn a more posterior chain dominant squat pattern.